Afternoon. Welcome to the Old Fashioned Festival. If it went for you folks sitting right out here, this wouldn't happen. And that's why we're here. Uh, again, my name is Russ Thomas. I'm the chair of this year's Old Fashioned Festival. And uh, I'd like to welcome everyone to the Sponsors Luncheon. So, moving on. Uh, it, this time, uh, it's now time to meet our royalty that we have out here. It represents the Newburgh Old Fashioned Festival and they do it not only during the festival but also at various other uh, venues around the state. Um, and they've done quite a bit for us. And uh, it's with great pleasure that I'm able to introduce them today and I'd like to do that right now. And uh, as I do that, ladies, please come up here and join me on the stage. Princess Sally Jo Karpstein. Princess Irene Leggett, and this year's 2010 Festival Queen, Sarah Grant. Come on up, ladies. And what, what I'm having to do is just come up here and, and just give you a little bit about themselves and uh, talk to you, um, and a little background. And we're going to start off with uh, Sally Jo. So, Princess Sally Jo. Hello everybody, um, well it's so nice to see you all and I want to give you all a big turbo thank you for all of the work that you've done to make this wonderful event possible and that sounds like it's totally rehearsed but I mean it from the bottom of my heart because this is wonderful and what you guys have done, you've transformed an ordinary but wonderful park into something that is a big draw for the community, it brings everybody together and I'm really grateful. And oh, um, I'm Princess Sally Jo Karpstein and I'm 18 and stuff like that. <laughs> but um, mostly thank you guys. This isn't about me, this is a sponsor's luncheon and it's about you, so thank you. Hello everyone, my name is Princess Irene Leggett. Just let me tell you right now, you guys rock every single one of you for making this happen. Without your generous donations, your time, creativity, and your gift to the community, this wouldn't happen. And it's really a great event that happens every summer. It's like Disneyland in Newburgh, and it's really a great and wonderful thing to happen. And thank you, everyone. It's without you guys, it wouldn't be possible. <laughs> Queen Sarah Grant. Um, I probably should say anything else because they pretty much summed it all up, but I will. It's really great to have all the sponsors. I mean, this wouldn't be possible without you guys. Uh, West Coast Bank, a lot of money there, and all, everybody just helped out so much. It, it was a great deal, and I know all of us are very thankful, and thank you guys so much. I'm going to be 17 soon, and I go to CSS Academy, so thank you. Now I get to do a little fun stuff here. These girls aren't aware of this, but on behalf of the Newburgh Old Fashioned Festival Committee, I'd like to take this opportunity to present them a savings bond for $400 for all their hard work and everything that they have done for the Old Fashioned Festival and the city of Newburgh as a whole. So Sally Jo, thank you very much. Irene, thank you. And Sarah. Thank you very much. Like I said, that's the fun part. Uh, these girls represent Newburgh and, and very graciously at over 60 events such as Sheridan Fun Days, St. Paul Rodeo, Carlin Days, Sherwood Robin Hood Festival, etc. Being on the Old Fashioned Festival Court is not just wearing pretty outfits for four days in July. And these girls can attest to that. They, they've dug in, rolled up their sleeves, and got along with the rest of us. They have attended all of our weekly meetings for the festival committee. Uh, they sell raffle tickets, carnival wristbands. They've taken their turns on shift rotation in the information booth, and you'll see them in there. Various uh, errands. They've helped around at uh, all kinds of community events. They're going to be helping serve breakfast here with Rotary. Uh, and in general, they help keep all of us on the committee young. So it's great to have them around. And so let's give these young ladies a round of applause. 